Hello, you're welcome to another episode of Healthy Cereals. My name is Anu Atunshei and today we're going to be making a healthy Zobo drink, hibiscus drink. I have five cups of hibiscus leaves and five cups of the leaf crumbs. Look at the difference. Can you see the difference? Yes. Give the leaves a quick rinse and sieve out the water immediately. I'll use this one liter measuring cup to measure the water. Pour five liters of water, and I mean drinking water. Well, the leaves will boil, but I still prefer to use the water I drink for this preparation. Cover the pot and allow to soak for some hours, say three hours or five hours, or even overnight. You can do this the previous day. Here are some spices. One tablespoon of peppercorns, one tablespoon of cloves, two medium-sized ginger roots, one stick of cinnamon, three negro peppers, three cloves of garlic. Have a nearer view of what the spices look like. I will boil everything in this jug. Chop them into bits and break them with your fingers where possible. Pour five ml of water into the jug and boil it and let the spices thaw very well into the water you can also do this and keep overnight or you continue with the other preps get your fruits four pineapples then nine oranges the watermelon whatever the number for this recipe i need 500 ml of pineapple juice five slices of of pineapple peel will be boiled with the hibiscus or zobo leaves this is the juice extractor cup, added to one liter. These two measuring cups will help me a lot in the preparation of this drink. Pineapple juice, I need 500 ml. Kindly watch this video to the end to see some of the ways you can serve this drink to enjoy it and also serve different occasion. This will be boiled with the hibiscus leaves. This is not the drink you do in a hurry where you put everything i mean all the ingredients all at once like the instant zobo drink i made in my very first youtube video hmm. have you watched my first video on youtube the link is in the description kindly watch my first video on youtube and leave a comment for the orange i need 500 ml normally about six of these medium sized oranges will make up the mark but in the event the orange is not juicy enough, we'll use more than six. Use the bigger sieve for a faster filtration. Add half an orange peel to the residues and pulp got from the juicing. We move over to prep the watermelon. 1000 ml of watermelon juice is needed for this recipe. Remember all the fruits, pineapple, orange, watermelon are to be washed properly before slicing and juicing. This will be boiled with the hibiscus leaves. Get your date syrup ready. 2 liters of date syrup is what is needed. I made a video on how to make date syrup at home. The link is in the description. So you set all this aside. Now to the soaked hibiscus leaves. This is after three hours. I'm going to dip a bright color spoon into the pot so we can appreciate the redness of the color. Bring to a boil, sieve and pour three liters of water into the pot and boil again. This time, all the pineapple peel, orange peel and pulp including all the residues from the juice extractor. Cover the pot and allow to boil. Keep watching to see how to enjoy this drink. Get a strainer to sieve the spices. Keep the juice. Then pour the spices left in the jug into the miller. Measure 500 ml of water and pour some of the water into the miller and, and grind. Don't forget we still have some water from the 500 ml of water measured. So use the remaining to rinse up the paste and the meal 
I mean the blender cup into the measuring cup. Get a sieve to strain the water or the juice. We are going to use this additional strainer. It has a finer mesh. I don't want the Zobo drink to be pasty or thick. I want it to be a pure juice. That's the reason for passing it through the yellow sieve. If you're new to my channel, you're welcome. Kindly subscribe to my channel, share my videos. Pour the remaining residue into a container and keep in the freezer. There are still some nutrients in all these. There are spices you can use for pepper soup and even for your general cooking. So it's not a waste. It is now time to mix everything together. Any other can be followed. Hibiscus drink or hibiscus tea or zobo drink has a lot of health benefits. It is rich in antioxidants, it contains vitamin C, it lowers blood pressure and it's a good source of iron. It also promotes healthy hearts. This flavorful drink is easy to make but should be taken in moderation. If you're new on this channel, you're welcome. Thank you for watching this video right now. Kindly subscribe and hit the notification bell and click all so that you'll be notified each time I post a video. Some people enjoy taking it as a hot tea. Most people prefer it to be served chilled. Which do you prefer? <laughs> I have a little arithmetic for you. How many liters of liquid in all? The water and the juices inclusive. How many liters of liquid did we use to make this Zobo drink? Can you leave your answer in the comments? Thank you. This drink can replace your sodas or carbonated drinks. Always remember moderation is the key. The spices you add to should be moderate. The dates I added is to sweeten the drink. You may add more if you feel the measurement I gave for the syrup is small. Especially when you want to consider the fact that you may throw some ice cubes into the drink. This applies to all juices as well. You can adjust to suit your need or purpose. But for me, it's fine for my taste buds. <laughs> Yes, I present to you our all-natural, spiced, healthy, pineapple flavor hibiscus drink. Here's a bonus for watching till this time. Right now, I crave for a drink that has coconut flavor. Let's experiment it with this hibiscus drink. Here's the coconut already washed, remove the water, break open and remove the meat from the husk. Cut into thin or tiny slices, pour into the blender and add one and a quarter cup of water and blend. Sieve it and keep one cup for the zobo. Keep the remaining quarter cup for future use or you drink it. You have a lot in the sieve. Keep it in the freezer. It has a lot of fiber. Keep it for your bread recipes or some of your delicious coconut recipes. Measure two cups of the hibiscus drink. Stir nicely. It may want to separate into thin cups because the drink has acid. I mean the citric acid from the pineapples and oranges and the coconut milk is milk. Just the way lemon juice will interact with milk but this case is a very mild one. The main idea is just to have a taste of the coconut flavor. Well, it's just an experiment and it came out well. Fill up your bottle or storage container. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you've not done so. I will see you in my next video. Stay safe, stay blessed. Bye.